What's up, y'all? This uh, Dito channel with this guy, the one and only. The bald Dan. dude. <laughs> and there's the Marvin channel here. Yep. Back at it again with having some. We uh, we came back. We are back. In oh, Sabrina, huh? Hey, Sabrina. I didn't see you there. Uh, I just had to pour some water all over myself to you know, walk all this way. Mm -hmm. Sis, I don't get why it doesn't really have to be this hot. You know, this guy's trying to be Triple H. I mean, no, it's not that. It's because, like, dude, it's so fucking hot that I just don't want to just stay out there in the sun all day. Yeah, I want to try some uh, Austin, uh, Austin uh, bi biscuit uh, sandwich from Blake Shelton. So <laughs> country, uh, country style. That's real. I still have a few more batteries left. A few more batteries. Huh? Yeah. Okay. Yep. Hey, look at this one. You see this, guys? Double well, I'm, burger. I'm doing good. Look at this shit, this, man. Shit, man. This, this boy is looking at this boy. Double. Yeah. It's like they're, they, have, they have some three burgers here, so. Yeah, I'm trying to, you know, stay healthy. I'm trying to stay healthy. I'm not trying to eat that much. Yeah. Look at my sandwich. It's a grilled chicken sandwich. Yeah, I'm not trying to eat so much junk either because um, I'm trying to, um, I feel, I'm still um, trying to get healthy too. I just, I'm just, I'm just tr trying not to eat so much um, junk and fat for your health. Yeah, this yeah. one. Yeah, because my mom, you know, has been telling me that, you know. If... <laughs> you what? <laughs> nah, I'm just joking. <laughs> Hell yeah. Hell yeah, because, you know, because the sweat got in my eye. Drinking too much sugar. Yeah. I, yeah, I'm not trying to drink too much sugar. Well, I mean, I do drink diet. What's up, Kevin? Oh, I do drink a little. Hey, uh, Kevin. Uh, just to let you know, um, my other know. channel. Wait, let me. Uh, too me. much. My other channel. Uh, my original other channel was uh, a little bit hack and you know scam. So I make another uh, final channel, Kevin. Just to let you know. Next time we should invite Ricky. You know, we can always just go, just just three, three of us. Yeah. Well. Wait, didn't we saw Ricky last time when we were at McDonald's? Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. I mean, we should have said what's up or something. Yeah, that's something Yeah, because the last thing he told me, he said he's gonna treat me and Marvin to Wendy's. That's what he said in PE. Yeah, yeah, and right. well, did that ever happen? No. No. Okay. Just hold on. All right. All right. Let me uh let me type my uh my YouTube channel because um yeah. So this is this is my um YT uh channel right here. What's up, Jose? Hold on. We are back. We are we just came back. So so this is my uh YT channel. So let me uh just. Just copy it or just write it down, uh, Kevin. Just write it down. Just write it down. And yeah, that's my YouTube channel. Like, Louis is like, damn, damn, you're trying to get more subscribers <laughs> on YouTube. Yeah. Okay. So I'm a YouTuber. You're an expert. Yep. You and Marvin are experts. Mm -hmm. Exactly. So I really don't go on Facebook that much because um, I don't really spend all the time over there. Yeah, I don't spend a lot either because... Um, Me? I don't... Well, here's the I don't thing. Want that I don't have time because, Hello. you know, I'm too busy dealing with sprouts, dealing with, you know, some... Life stuff? Yes, yeah, life stuff. These are my double burgers, so I, I eat... This oh, what's up, Jose? Oh, oh, Yeah, I, I already learned my lesson. I'm not going to lose my wallet this time. 
In fact, it's with me right now. Okay, I got it. And I am going to follow you here. All right, Kevin, thank you. What's up, DF Network? What's up, bro? Oh yeah, just to let you know, make sure to tune in for my Resident Evil. Hmm. What number was it, Marty, to, uh, when you came to my channel? Uh, it was actually number. It was actually number. Number six. Number six. Number seven. So, what are you? By the on? way, it was. Yeah, you should play number seven. It was because a, you got. You know. And you, you gotta play number I'm, eight. I'm planning to, it. you know, get that because I already have a the Spider-Man 10-inch uh, Funko Pop. I'm planning to get like also what? Am I eating? I'm an eating Iron Man and a Batman. Uh, Yeah. Okay. So I mean, yeah, every time when you play on Resident Evil, I say on don't don't do it. What's that restaurant? What is it, guys? What restaurant? Dia Nick was asking the question. What is the restaurant? That we it's went? called Wendy's. Wendy's. We Wendy's. went to Wendy's. Wendy's. Yeah, like. It's Wendy's. Yeah. Wendy's. Yeah. Wendy's. Yeah. Wendy's. Yeah. Wendy's. Yeah. Wendy's. I mean, I just don't want to go outside. Oh yeah. I hate it. Yeah, because it's like. You know, you got, you see how my boy I was? Yeah. I was sweating at the wall. Yeah, like, that's why, for me, I had just, you know, just pour water all over on me, so that way... Me, I had a splash from water in my face. Mm -hmm. You keep me away. Mm -hmm. sandwich, though. Yeah. You got nuggets? Mm-hmm. Yeah, look what I got. Sandwich. Go check a sandwich. I got mm -hmm. it. Let's do okay, Kev. Just make sure, just make sure for watching my videos first. Mm. Yeah, just make sure to watch my videos. It's really important to do that. Uh, mm. Yeah. Well, I know some people can help your channel out too, buddy. So yeah, you gotta send oh, me the link. Jose, Jose, Jose wants to uh, join in. Go ahead. Yeah. But yeah, uh, Kevin, just send me the link to somebody that can help me out. Grow. I need a lot of help. You know. Oh, what's up, Luis? You guys. Are... Oh, what's, what's up, man? Uh, how, uh, how, how are you doing? guys? Wait, are, are you guys out for um, for McDonald's for lunch? Oh yeah, we're at Wendy's right now. We're back. We're oh, back. Wendy's. Oh, Wendy's. Oh, I was like, get Wendy's for lunch. Well, this guy had like, looks like he had like three like meat, oh, three burgers. There are three patties though. Dang. <laughs> oh yeah, dang! It's like Rock Lesnar. Yeah. Yeah. So anyway, when we were walking over here, I had to pour water all over myself, I man, because oh, like, oh, it's, it's hot. It's, it's hot over here. Yeah. I'm wearing a white t-shirt and some shorts. That's why. Yep. So that's why I'm like saying to myself, because you know, it's just 88 degrees now. It is? In Hercules? Well, well, no. Well, yeah, that this, too. Kevin, yeah, that too. This, but like, uh, this, no. my oh, Kevin. someone, Omega. Oh, hey, how's it going? Uh, that's someone my friend Tommy from uh, adult oh. school. Oh okay, yeah. Oh, wow. oh wow. So wait, so yeah, I can't believe I can't believe you lost you lost your wallet though. You know, I told my parents about my I don't I told my parents about they, my, they're like, hey mom, dad, you won't believe what happened to Luis. Luis, he lost his freaking wallet, and then next thing you know, he, you got it back. Oh my god, thank god. Yeah, thank goodness for that. But I already learned my lesson from that, and that's not gonna happen. Thirty seven. Yeah, they, hey, yeah. Don't worry. Hey, come on. I always kept my wallet in my front pocket, so I don't want anyone. Because you know what, obviously, because you might they might take your ID, your ident, your well, your uh, bank account card, and everything else too. Oh, any valuable yeah. information. That's called yeah, like, that's called identity theft. I didn't know about that. Yeah, tell me about it. Oh yeah, but I did want to tell you though. So after yesterday, because I did show you that I got that Spiderman uh, Funko 10 inch. Well, I'm planning to get the Batman one and the Iron Man one. Which one? The new one? Oh man, uh, I, I want to get the new Batman Funko Pop, but the one from right here. Yeah, but you know, all I have is all I have is the George Clooney one, the Kevin Conroy, the Ben Affleck, 
and the other one too, and also the Dio de los Muertos one. Go make sure to. Have you ever thought about getting like ten inches? Out to the audience. Um, maybe. Well, well, um, I don't know. Um, let's see. I think I have some room here on my um, on my on my bookshelf. Like, like I got these at the at a garage sale. The three Deadpool's. Well, damn. Yep. Uh, oh, I, look! I got this is from the uh, from the Batman, the cartoon. Oh yeah. Okay. I man, sorry, it's because the, it's because yeah. the sweat got in okay. my eye. Okay. I did. Oh man, she goes. Yeah, oh uh, my god! Sure How hot is it over there? Oh my gosh! Make sure over here, uh, well, but uh, I just got a statue of Bruce Lee right here. See, I got it for my birth from a present. Dang! How much? Yeah. How much was it? I, I didn't. It was a present. I don't know how much it was, but um, but I just got it from uh, last week when I went me or uh, a friend of my a friend of my uh, a, f a friend of the family named Lena invited mm -hmm. us to Benihana and uh, I well well when I got to their house though I opened like uh, some presents I got uh, these uh, Yin Yang stress balls uh, Bruce Lee statue right there he's all angrily a T shirt and a book that says Be Water My Friend and Batman stickers too. Oh, I see. Yeah. yeah, so I got I, I got the yeah. So it was my first time going to Benihana. So yeah, it's because well, right now I'm here because I'm here at uh <clears throat> at Terra Hills. Oh, yeah, I'm I'm not actually at Hercules. Right now. My my yeah. mom's over there. Huh. Yeah. Oh, oh by the way, I finished up I finished the the book of Boba Fett the other day. I didn't get to finish it because I was too busy, you know, dealing oh. with work and all that. Oh yeah. Well, I I, well, I already did though. I'm not working until Thursday, so. But tomorrow I'm gonna go to the DMV though to uh, pass my right, my second written test. Oh yeah, well I thought because hey, by test. the way, yeah, because I'm thinking about because something I should have done back when I graduated from high school in 2013, I should have got a car, but it's just I don't know. Sometimes my mind can like you know get ahead of. Like, yeah, I know. I know. I didn't get a car yet, too, but they were doing some um, um deep learning how to drive though back in high school or after school. So, and there were some other students who got their driver's license though too. But I had, I couldn't, I couldn't like have time to do my Jimmy Bull because I was starting. I was like in school though. I can't be two places at once, and, and I couldn't concentrate. I guess so because I, I was because I, I, I was busy with school and everything else too. So, but. Since I'm like since I'm like turned twenty six though, it's time for me to, to learn how to drive though when pass the written D V test though and then my dad's gonna teach me how to drive though and then that then I have the observer though too. Yeah, the, yeah, the thing is you gotta be on the road. When you like pass your written test though, you're gonna have to wait, you gotta get a driver's permit and then wait. Wait and then you gotta ask your mom and dad to teach you how to drive though, and then you gotta like be behind the wheel though, and then and then after that when once you go back to the D M V you gotta like do the to, they have, you're gonna have an observer to see and gonna check you like what you're gonna do be on the road like throwing your headlights your blinkers your blinkers what else and also your mirrors your seatbelts yep. too and yeah and also and also emergency stop though and also turn yeah you gotta be focused on the road like don't let it be yeah, don't let anything distract you and no phone calling no too but there are also crazy people drivers out there too yeah that's why you know what because well I need to find that book because I think by now, because I'm. Oh, they have it in the D. The cat, it's in the California DMV. You just ask one for you. Just ask for it's like, hey, you got a DMV book, and just give you one, and you start reading it. Yep. But the latest issue, the latest one they gave me was the twenty. It's from one from last year, twenty twenty one. I've been reading the twenty twenty one. Oh, because I'm about to be twenty seven this year. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Yeah. So, so but uh, yeah. Yeah, I hear that because you need to. Yeah, because you. Need, yeah, uh, yeah. Well, they got two demon books. One for driving, and the other one for motorcycle, like Eddie Brock. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, remember the part he's like, "Well, I'm not gonna lie, that was pretty up." <laughs> oh, 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 yeah, oh, I remember. Oh, oh I, I picked my broke my arm again. Yeah, <laughs> you picked my fucking back. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> Hello, Eddie. <laughs> oh. <laughs> what the, who's there? Uh, yeah, right. Don't, uh, right, hey, yeah, hey, hey, uh, hey, hey, um, hey, yeah, have you seen, have you been to like a cop tree or something like? Just like yes, I just did. Oh, really? Good. Yeah, you know, you know, but you know, I did see the movie. By the way, I did watch Moon Knight though. Oh, I wasn't. 
Oh, it was pretty good, though, too. Plus, you playing that Frank Sinatra song every time I wake up. Damn. Yeah, it's, yeah, there, yeah. You should have seen it. You should watch the series, though. Well, I have to rewatch it again. I didn't. I hardly pay attention to it, though. But I may have to rewatch it again. Oh yeah, it's because well, the problem is because Disney it's Oscar Plus... Isaac. They got the part. They, it's Oscar Isaac. He got he playing as um two characters named Patrick and uh and uh and this one British guy. So. Oh, I see. Yeah, but yeah. you know, uh, it's just a Disney Plus because the problem is. Well, it gets annoying is these passwords. Yeah, well, I don't have Disney Plus. I have Tenchi's, so I can wa I watch it there. Uh, well, because I gotta watch uh, the Book of Boba Fett, because I gotta find out like what actually happened. <laughs> because yeah, because right now yeah, because the next show they're gonna show the next one they're gonna show is um is uh the Star Wars Obi Wan Kenobi. Oh yeah, speaking of that, you know how you. I heard they were about to, you know, well, they were about to put Darth Maul on it, but I heard that, like, he was, he's out of there. I don't, yeah, I don't so know. Yeah, now, now it's going to be Darth Vader and Uncle O, and, and also a young Luke Skywalker as a kid, though, because he's born, because he made a problem, he made a vow to himself to watch over uh, Luke Skywalker as a baby when he gave it to, uh, to, to Owen and Peru from back in Star Wars Episode Two. Uh, actually, episode three. At the end of episode three. <laughs> oh yeah! Ever since you know, Revenge of the Sith happened. Yeah. Like, yeah. So, so, cause, well, my thing is, is that, okay. Well, what if, what if, uh, you know, like, okay, I want to say, like, it would have been better if you know, Windu would have went to Urupao to fight Grievous instead of like Obi Wan. Yeah. That's but, a total what if in Star Wars. Yeah, it's just like in Marvel, though. I see Marvel's what if. So, like, what if Thor was an early child? What if Doctor Strange, like, lost the person he loves? Yeah, I mean. Yeah, they show, like, a total what if, including what part where Iron Man gets injected with that little thing, and that virus from Iron Man 2. Guess what? He actually died, and it turns out, though, it was Doctor Hank Prim. Yeah, because, like, ever since, well... Back when Iron Man, you know, two happened. Well, there was some. I think there was like. Oh, yeah. Well, I'll throw it for you, man. Before, because oh, even after when Iron Monger died. Oh yeah, in the third, from the first one with Jeff Bridges. Mm -hmm. The second villain was Whiplash. That's his name. <clears throat> oh. Yeah, because I mean, I'm wondering like. What history did he have with, you know, the Stark, the Stark industry? I mean, because I heard his dad used to work there. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, his dad used to work there. I don't know. Well, I think his dad used to work there, though, too. Well, and then he must have got fired or maybe tired, though. Tired, though. And all of a sudden, and all of a sudden he showed, and then during a convention, you know, where Iron Man jumps out of a cargo plane, you know, he's all like, oh, it's good to be back. And all of a sudden, he's already playing uh, yeah. everything about his life, and then and he shows like an old video of his father, like, "Hi, I'm Howard Stark. You may know me." And it shows like uh, a monument of the future. Oh uh, yeah, yeah. And then all of a sudden, he just grabs like, and then all of a sudden, he starts doing algebra, chemistry, and next thing you know, he grabs some sort of. He did something like, uh, kind of like, uh, like this. All right, all right, give it to me. And, and all of a sudden, like, uh, yeah, this because so this is what you're planning, Dad. Unbelievable. Okay. Well, and then yeah, and yeah, yeah, and then and then and then he started making a new heart, which is a triangle one. Yeah, mm. I will be back. Yeah. yeah, and he's all like, oh, <laughs> "Tastes like coconut." <laughs> yeah. uh, he was just telling me about like you know uh, Iron Man movies. Oh, like... okay. <coughs> hey, what's up, Jose? Oh, hey, hey, Marvin. Yeah, I was Iron Man. I was talking about Iron Man too. Oh, I see. Um, oh, I see. Oh, oh, are you in your room right now? Or where are you at? Uh, the living room. Oh, living room. Oh, okay. Oh, uh, this is my li yeah, yeah. This is my, my my bedroom's in my over there though too. I was looking for my mom. Okay, I, was, so I was gonna have some wings for lunch. I know you didn't hear that in the background, right? I was just watching some. Uh, in the background, I'm just watching some uh, legacies on YouTube. Oh, oh, Iron Man too. <laughs> nice. Yep. So anyway, yeah, like I was saying, was like you know, um, cause after that, 
well, Iron Man before you know that rape, that racing incident. And oh yeah, yeah, that, yeah. yeah. He, was, well, he was in Italy or France mm-hmm. or something like that. Yeah. Yeah, and it, yeah, and then all of a sudden, yeah, I remember when I saw the trailer. I I was in middle school when it came out, and the only thing I remember in the trailer though was where he hits the car, his car, racing car, and all of a sudden he's fighting him, and all of a sudden, he's, oh, 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 oh. give me the kill, go, give, give me the case, give me the case, and I give me that case, and all of a sudden he puts it on on his chest, everything else is calling armor and everything else too, and then, and he's all fighting, he's all shooting blasters up, but one got in- damaged, and then all of a sudden he got the, and then he all of a sudden he tied the rope. Start punching him in the stomach in the face and knock him down. Oh yeah, but the one thing was strange about his legs. Haven't you ever witnessed his legs like falling apart? What uh, I I met with his no whiplash. Oh yeah, yeah. I think I, I think I do remember that though too. But I, I but I won't forget that once he after he defeated them, he's all like, <laughs> "You lost, you lost," and he got and he got the heart and he just destroyed it. Oh my god. Yeah, and like. Cause he knows. Oh, but, but by the way, though, you know, I think my friend Vicky told me about that. That kid with the Iron Man suit, though, and the mask and the repulsor. Oh, I think that's that's Tom Holland as a kid. Put that on. Damn, no wow. wonder. Yeah, you know, yeah, he was he was the kid back in two thousand eight. I was twelve years old. That was he actually. Yeah, he, he actually made the truth yeah. that that was him as a kid. So, I was in high school. I was wait, like a freshman. Two thousand eight. I mean, um, no, wait. <laughs> No, not really. No, no, I'm tripping. No, actually, 20, wait, actually, Iron Man 2 came out in 2011, so. I was 15. Oh, I was 12. I think I was like, I think I was like in, uh, actually, I was like, uh, somewhere in, my, somewhere in my teens, though. Yeah, I think like, hang on, 2011, what was I? I think I was like 13 or 14. So I'm going to be live on GTA 5. Oh. Yeah, I forgot. Though, but I know 2011 is where I was like, in my early teens, my like early teens or something like that, uh, my mid teens or early teens or late teens, something yeah, like that, something like that. Though, you guys are about to go now. Not yet. You take your time. Oh, okay. Yeah. So well, yeah, and Iron Man three came out when I was in high school. So. <clears throat> oh yeah, but you know, um, I was thinking, man, because since. By then, I heard that when Iron Man uh, 2 came out, there was like a burger at uh, Burger King that I never tried out. It was called, uh, the, the like, what was it called? The, the Whipper, the Wop. Whatever. Something like that, though, back in, back in 2011, though. But, yeah, they were ha- yeah, Iron Man was pretty popular then. Plus, even the video game came out, too. Too, though, Iron Man 2 and then Iron Man 1. Baddies, yeah, <laughs> yeah, that, that was the good old days, though. But even That's even yeah. uh, other Marvel video games too. But now they just now they just stopped. Uh, now they're doing future Marvel project game like yeah, Spider Man yeah. number two and Wolverine. Oh yeah, because well, I can't wait for that game to come out and the Wolverine. Not just that and Spider Man game. Yeah, same. Same and also Spider Man Across the Spider Verse Part One. That's coming out and also Thor Love and Thunder. Everybody, oh, everybody yeah. was like, like, oh, this time, because yeah. remember back then, so Thor was kind of chubby. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean. Yeah, and, yeah, he was chubby, though, but then all of a sudden he get, and, and all of a sudden he has to work out oh, using yeah. the, the death skeleton from that lava monster from the third one. And he has to do workout, <laughs> get back into shape. And and, and, guess, and guess what? He got his yeah. hammer back. Guess who got the, and guess who's, and guess what? He's no, not allowed. No, He's with Jane Port Foster again, no. which is Lady no. Thor. His ex girlfriend, huh? Yeah, yeah. She became a yeah. She became a Thor too, and as Guardian Thor. I, I saw her master and was like, oh, so so. How long has it been? Eight years? No, well, I guess it's been eight years though. I mean, <clears throat> my thing is, why did they broke up in the first place? I don't know. Oh, did, did you see the trailer though? Oh yeah, but I'm yeah. just curious about like what exactly like happened that they broke up like back then. Yeah, I mean, I mean, I, mean, I saw the new trailer. I saw the new trailer though, and I was laughing the part though where Zeus like, "Let's see who you are." Too go too hard, damn it! I was like, "Oh my god, this this door butt naked!" Oh my god. Yeah, you know what? I was thinking maybe. What if? Anyways, sorry about that. I was just thinking, like, I was thinking, like, you know, what if Thor, because 
You remember, like, in Ragnarok, he he mentioned about, you know, Jane, that yeah. they they just broke up. Yeah, well, but he, yeah, 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 yeah. And all of a sudden, and he told Loki, like, we didn't broke up. It's just that, you know, she, has, she couldn't take care of my thing because, you know, I'm a god. She's like a human being, you know, so too. And all of a sudden, he too goes, asked for a selfie. And he just did, oh, he yeah. did though, as a nice, polite. And next thing you know, Dr. Strange called him. Oh, yeah. To come over and, to, then from... and then Thor thought that, you know, that was Loki at first. But no, that was actually uh, Dr. Strange. And yeah. by the time they were talking, discussing about something that he found his father. And then next thing you know, he just, like, brings back Loki. And then Loki was about to kill him. And... <laughs> Yeah, because I mean, I was like, magic versus magic. Oh yeah. Hey. Oh wait. Did you watch Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness? Nah, not yet. I oh, mean, man. well, I already, I already want to go watch it already though. Well, I heard it was, I heard it was good though. Yeah, it is good. Yeah, I mean, there, I'm, yeah, the only, per you know, I was like the only, the only more movie that did suck this year was Morbius. I don't know why. I was like the only peep. It was only me, my mom, and the other couple of people wanted to go see it though. I don't know why they didn't like it. Oh yeah, I heard about that too. They did not like it. I mean, well, I mean, Jared Leto playing as Morbius. I mean, he's perfect for the part. I mean, and they had Matthew Smith from uh, Doctor Who playing as the bad guy. My love. Yeah, I mean, sometimes though, when see, it's like I don't know. Same, I mean, you know, same goes for Iron Fist though. They casted Finn Jones as Iron Fist, and they didn't like it. Oh my gosh. Mm, I don't know what's going on. I mean, I mean, he's British. So that's because it's supposed to have like an Asian American to play Iron Fist, but what? Yeah. But Iron Fist supposed to be like an American kid named Danny Rand. So then, what is exactly like? I'm trying to figure out because then I'm confused. Oh, what? What? Uh, Iron Fist? Something like that. Yeah. Yeah. Well, all right. Well, in the comics, well, Danny Danny Rand supposed to be like a. Uh, uh, Supposed to be a millionaire kid though, who cried to crash who lost his parents though by some sort of bad guy in the comic. So and then all of a sudden he went to this uh, ancient place called Kowloon, where he learned martial arts there for like years until he came back. But in the series though, he had a plane crash and then all of a sudden these monks found him and took him in and he started training there. So yeah, because I mean, plus, I and, plus, and, plus, and he has a dragon tattoo on his chest. It looks a lot like this. Oh yeah, because like. If you remember, well, I remember back then when that Sp Ultimate Spider-Man series back in 2012 happened. Yeah. That's when, you know, not just him and Nova, Iron Fist, and White Tiger. Yeah. They were a, they were a team up. Yeah, they were a team up. Yeah, it was classic. It's called Ultimate Spider-Man with Drake Bell. Yeah, back then. Yeah, that's, that, was, that was after he did that, that, that silly, ridiculous parody spoof movie of Batman and Spider-Man. Well, oh, shit. <laughs> I don't know what the, you know, what they're like. You might want to say it's like, kind of like a spider bat. <laughs> yeah, but it, it, it wasn't a, it wasn't a spider bat. He got, he got bitten by a dragonfly because he put this, because when this one guy named Lance, almost like a reference of Flash Thompson, just pushed him in a, a, a pile full of shit, which is crap. And he got, he got stained on his shirt. So he went to go get like a, a bottle of spray to spray it off. And it'll turn all of a sudden the doctor said it was H209. And all these animals trying to get him, though. And one guy was like, yeah, take that bitch. Take that. All of it. Some snails did that, too. And then all of a sudden, he comes home. He's, like, puking. And next thing you know, he's having a nightmare of um, of, of Hourglass Man. He's, like, a green goblin. And next thing you know, remember the video? And all of a sudden, he's all, like, next thing you know, he wakes up. And he told, he went on his computer, though. Like, have you found any sexual intercourse? Yes. No, like, are you shooting me? You like, remember? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, yeah, and all of a sudden, wait, and all of a sudden, Mr. Professor is texting me on Facebook. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, man. And all of a sudden, he sees a girl next door, though. And then he gets in a fight with him at the science project fair at school. School, though. And all of a sudden, he gets punched in the face. Yeah, and he's like, never let your guard down, right? <laughs> yeah. I don't know. When I watched the movie again, though, I was, like, totally laughing, though. Even the part at the end where he gets depressed that he just decided to give up playing Dragonfly. <laughs> yeah, and he also, you see, and, and all of a sudden, there's, like, people sleeping on the sleeping on the streets, though, an airbag, though. 
Beardo, and all of a sudden he's going to Beardo. Look at yourself. You're you're going to the press now. I mean, you're going to fake Beardo. Yeah. Yeah. But so also because it's kind of like when then they had a reference of that. You know, I'm not going to say it, but you know what I mean by that. Oh, X Men or Batman. Yeah. Hmm. Uh, that's because, that's because, you know, it's because it was back in 2000, though. There was, like, scary movies, like, in the 80s. There was, like, Airplane, Scary Movie, and other an Epic Movie, and meet, Superhero Movie, and Meet the Spartans. So, that was the third movie. That was their uh, third movie they did. And the fourth and final one, though, was Disaster Movie. That didn't like it. They, it was totally bad, though. After that, it was no more. But Perry's not dead, though. They, they have this thing on YouTube called The Warp Zone and College Humor. So... Oh, okay. Yeah, so, yeah, I mean, they haven't shown any parody movies, though. The last one I ever saw, though, was a parody of The Hunger Games and The Hunger of The Hangover and The the Hunger Games. Like, call it The Starving Games and also The Hungover Games. Oh, shit. Oh, dang. But, yeah, they were, know, it was on Tubi when, when I watched it, though. Me and my, I was, like, laughing so hard. They're doing, like, a reference of, yeah. of a Fruit Ninja and Angry Birds, too, and other, and other like, oh, things they do. <sighs> So, yeah, I don't know. I think because they want to do that movie, though, called because it's like a reference parody of uh, they want to like do reference of Fantastic Four, which is the old one, and also, um, and also Visible. They did like a parody of Fantastic Four, though, by Soul and X Men, too, too, though. And even the part, though, he's like, Oh, you want a little secret of make your power? Ow! Make a costume, shithead! A costume? Yeah, and you know what? Like, because. I was like, it looked kind of like similar, like, you know, kick ass, I want to say, but. Yeah, but kick, oh, yeah, kick ass, yeah, definitely kick ass. So. Yeah, like, oh, like, yeah, I mean, kick ass, well, kick ass, he doesn't have any superpowers, though, but he didn't have no train, he had no fighting skill train, though, till, until the second one. Because, you know, because, like, her father, like, bad big daddy, though, training him. Yet, yet, she had a bulletproof vest on to see if he got shot or not, though, and. And kick ass, he didn't, he didn't do like a lot of training though, and also he was called, he had martial arts trains though. Like, I, I forget that one, remember that one scene you told me about, like, hey, there's a real life superhero, superhero trying to save, trying to save, uh, trying to stop this one guy, guy was killing other, killing other guys. <laughs> yeah, because like, you know what? <laughs> Man. Yeah, and then Chris, even... yeah, but the, yeah, but even the scene though where, where Chris, where he blew up uh, Chris D'Amico's dad, the mob boss, with a bazooka. Yeah, yeah. I was like, "Holy shit!" He blew up the bazooka. <laughs> oh my god! Yeah, and, and, yeah. Well, in the se- and in the in the second one, Joe, he what? got I was like, "Mom, I want to." I'm so sad. Kick out right now. Dude, he killed Dad with a bazooka. No, he did. He died. He died of a of an accident. Oh god, I wish you. I hate you so much. I wish you were dead. Cool. And he, and he kicked her tanning. Yeah, well, tanning a little. And he's like, he's all like, "Mommy." <laughs> I was. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and he had like uh, John Leguizamo's character, Guillermo, that he's like an evil, that he's like an e- that he wa- and actually, you know, he wanted to hire an MMA, he wants to hire some like he wants to learn MX martial arts though to become a pro fighter though. Then he had the guy from Get Out though to train him, and well, and other villains said, "What did I say about the racist thing?" And John, so wait, oh, come on, come on, you're, you're, I'm like evil Bruce Wayne, like the evil Alfred. Did you just call me your fucking butler? <laughs> Man, but you know what? It's funny because, well, I mean, it's like there has been there has been you know some some comic books where in Batman, yeah, he met his his evil you know his evil self. Oh yeah, the the Owl Man. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. But this is I'm like yeah, but Kick Ass Two though was kind of well. When I saw Kick Ass Two though, I mean, I know at the end though they all they have all the heroes to fight against the super villains, and then. All of a sudden, he tried to say Chris D'Amico. Next thing you know, he saw him get eaten by a shark, though. But, he, but there's a bonus clip, though, that he's alive, though. And he has, he has his leg. He, and he got his leg bit off and his arm. Like, and he lost, like, a, some sort of limbs, though, in his body. Damn. Damn. Like, yeah, 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 yeah. There's a bonus clip. I got to show you one of these days, so. though. And, like, like say, hey, I want you to kick ass, too. And all of a sudden, I show the part, Al. Like, he's like, Al, I can't wait my drink. The shark picked my dick off. <laughs> yeah, and he's trying to reach for his drink, and that's why. But, but after that, though, they never made a third one, though. I don't know why. Because right now, they're focusing on the Marvel and DC universe now. Mm. But, 
Yeah, I muscle. mean, hey, hey, look, look, check it out, Mark. Look. My thing is though, like, even because Batman That's defeated, so you know, uh, Owl Man. I was like, off oh, in the cartoon. I, yeah, but then there was like one animated movie called Justice League's Quest on tour set. Owl Man beat the hell out of Batman, like he was about to kill him. Oh, which one? What was it called? Like uh, Justice League's Crisis on Two oh, Earths. Oh, Justice League Crisis on Two Earths. Oh, wow. Is that, a, is that from the animated series? No, well, not ex yeah. no, not exactly. Well, but temporarily. like, it's just an animated movie that yeah. Owlman almost, you know, was about to kill Batman when oh, he was wow. trying to. Yeah. Maybe, well, I was like, watch this other DC movie though called Catwoman Hunted. It's an animated film movie. Dang, but yeah. Yeah, but uh, it's all the shows Catwoman, Two Face, and, well, actually, Black Mask was a Two Face, okay. and so is uh, Kate Kane, Batwoman. Sure, yeah. Man, but <laughs> I'm just thinking because, like, right now, because I know yeah, they're about to, the, there's plenty more like, superheroes you know, movies like, yeah. about to come yeah. out uh, next year. Oh, wait, yeah, and also, uh, well, right now, me and my mom was watching the movie um yesterday. We watched yeah. The Northman yesterday mm -hmm. on Tenchi's. Man, yeah, I also watched that movie too. With what, the Northman? Huh? The Northman? No. That's a good one. No, not, not really. I was talking about, because the last movie, the moral movie I saw was, you know, Black Widow, uh, like, uh, Shang, what was it? Shang-Chi? Shang-Chi, yeah. And, like, then I was watching, uh, what was it? There you go. Oh, yeah. Eternals? Yeah. Anyway, hey, I'll say, uh, Marvin, Daniel, and I were about to get ready to go. Uh, okay, don't lose your wallet, by the way, because I'm really happy no. for you got your wallet back. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 Bye, guys. Take care. Take care, Jose. Bye. <laughs> she didn't see you there, man. Oh, wait, we had to go end it again. Yeah, right. I don't know. We got to give a shout out to your channel. Oh, yeah. So, anyway. So, go first. Oh. No, I, I didn't end it. All right. All so right. anyway, so I just want to just because Marvin, Daniel, and I, or should I just say, you know, the Marvin channel and yeah. the Daniel. Yeah. So been here for a while at Sprouts. I'm, yeah, my bad. Uh, Wendy's. Wendy's. My bad. <laughs> Sorry about that. I know. I know. So I'm just, anyways, so I, so. Shout out and uh, I leave, shout out my channel too. Also, myself. leave a thumbs up and like this Dito channel. And trying to say peace out, y'all, and uh, like give it a hoax smash. All right, I got something to say. All right, they're like shades, man. Here, so it's the Danner show in the house tonight. So just to let you guys know, make sure to full watch the video, drop a like. Leave a comment which related to the video. Share this out. Make sure to subscribe to the Daniel Show and then turn on the bell for notifications. So it's a random video. I might, I had to ask Louise, you know, his permission to, you know. Well, yeah, I already have his well, permission, right? Yeah, it's it's okay with me. Your turn. Right. Yeah. Also, come check out my channel, the Marvin channel, though, and um, just make sure make sure to come check out check out my videos, though. Um, make sure you watch the whole thing. And also, right. and also give a, yeah, and also give a like. Also come, also make sure you, you give a like as well for my videos though, when you're done watching, yes. watching though, and also, and also subscribe to my channel though as well for more for more uploads. So take care, guys. Peace, peace. All right, peace.